came about the ad, huh? Fine. You can undress in there. What? What do you mean, what? You saw the ad, didn't you? Art photography models. Cash paid immediately. Now, I got a guy waiting inside and a girl that didn't show up. It's 150 bucks. You want it or not? 150 bucks, honey. Cash. Okay. What do I do? Take your clothes off. Very nice. Jack! Yo! Get in here, let's go. Well, what are you waiting for? Get out of the rest of those schmatters. Hey, this is more like it. Young skin. Hey, everybody hold it. This is a bust. <sighs> Come on, Mario. See if we can find you some clothes. How you doing, Roland? I hope your rap sheet isn't too long, sweetheart, because this is the big one. You ever heard of conspiracy to commit oral copulation? Get that shirt on, baby. I gotta, I gotta cut you. Jesus. How old are you? Marina, it's just going to take a few minutes. Come on. Right. What happened with Carlos? Huh? Where are you going? Hey, can't agree to shit. You're doing business with me. I talk to Carlos. Nobody else. You talk to me or you walk with nothing, senor macho man. Okay. Okay. What do you got? <laughs> what do you got? Exactly, Mr. Bitch. As you know, it's an experimental program. The girls we have here would be eaten alive if they were thrown into a prison. But the crimes they have committed make it impossible to even consider placing them in halfway houses. Some of them are extremely dangerous. Yes?
This floor is devoted to medical checks for all our girls. Sick pay, medical research. Research? The state has allowed us to do a certain amount of experimentation with behavior modification. We are interested in trying to find the causes that have led them to anti-social acts. We also have a basement full of records dating back 40 years to show the lack of progress until we started. She looks harmless. Only a social worker would think like that. Um, she's in on manslaughter charges. Lori, you're next. This is where we say goodbye. I have a lot to do, and I think what you have seen will be able to answer any of the state's questions. I'm sure our funding will continue with no major problems, don't you? I hope so, Miss Madison. It's been an education. Can you find your way out? I'll manage. Thank you.
How you doing, Barb? Hi, Jen. What's happening? Everything okay with you two? Hi, Valeska. better to do than run your mouth off about me? Yeah, you're looking to get jammed, Dottie. Don't make me get up. If I do, I'll be twisting some tits. Dick, don't start anything. What are you looking at? Everybody's so mean. Laika, you're losing it. Who are you? Nobody. Nobody. We'll see. You have pretty eyes. What's the matter, honey? You look like you need something to make you feel good. I think I'm gonna get sick. Take it easy. I didn't get nothing to eat yet. Listen, I got some serious Man, there's some weird shit going down around here. I hope there ain't nothing queer in this food. How'd the strip go, babe? What you mean? Don't give me that bull. You holding? Girl, I don't know you, and I want you out of my face. Hey. Hmm. I'm on your side. You don't got? I can get. Oh, yeah? What are you, Madison sucker? Okay. You need something. You know where to come. Just remember. There's so much shit jammed in here during visiting hours, you wouldn't believe it. I know where all the bodies are buried. You get me? I got connections. <laughs> you want to get laid? You want to get high? You come to me. You come to Velasca. <laughs> Okay, everybody, listen up. Mail call. Ask who? Ask who? Elmore. Gato. Alan. It's from your mom, right? Bobby Love. What'd you say? Cleaver. Shut your hole, Rebel. Come on, Lisa. Boy. She got something for us? Yeah, she's got something. Boy. Only we gotta wait till we get out of here to get in on Morales. it. Oh, shit. Jones. It's tighter now than it's ever been. How are we Sergeant. gonna pull a split? Pierce. You leave that up to me. Hendricks. Shank. Hey. 
I hear you're in for the same thing as us. No, I... Look, don't get upset. <laughs> we were in town and on the streets for exactly one day when we got busted. I hadn't even turned a trick. And... Would you believe it? Jen is still a virgin. What the? Sorry, honey. I didn't see your little spit body sticking out in my way. you to understand that. Sure. Paige, I've asked your father to come and see you. I don't have to see him. You can't make me. Paige, do you know how lucky you are even to have a father? You know Barb and Jen, those two girls waiting outside? They have no one to depend on but each other. You've seen what it's done to them. They are sick. They've become ill. They think they have no one else to rely on. They live in a dream world. I know what you're doing. You can't make me think I'm like them. Paige, I am not. You think you're going to make me trust you because you tell me someone else's secrets. Well, you can forget it. I'm sorry you feel that way. Perhaps some medication will help you. I am making an appointment for you to see Dr. DeMichael this afternoon. Let's see what he can do for you. I won't see my father. I won't. We will talk about that later, Paige. Now you will have to excuse me. I have other girls to see. Mm. 
They come in regular yet? What? Don't jive me, Gloria. You're pregnant. Those floppy shirts ain't been hiding it so good lately. <laughs> oh, God. Please, don't tell anyone. They'll put me in a prison hospital. What are you gonna do? Have it in the mess hall? I don't know, but... Please, don't tell anyone. Please. It's your funeral, baby. I just hope it ain't the kids. tells me you're not in the mood to cooperate. There's nothing to cooperate about. You look like a reasonable girl to me. What seems to be the problem? There is no problem. Then why are you here? In your office? You know what I mean. Isn't it obvious? You've got my file. I'm a whore. Seems to me like you're a little rough on yourself. Yeah. I'm black and blue all over. I'd like to work with you without using medication. How do you feel about that? Let's talk about your health. How are you feeling today? You want to find out? Yes, of course. Then open me up.
Attention girls. Visiting hours will be held this afternoon in the mess hall. Hey, Daddy. I'm really sorry. You motherfucking scumbag. Hey, man, I don't need this shit. Baby, it's so good to see you. I miss you. I love you. Paco, you gotta get me out of here. Marina, it's not that easy. You gotta understand, you're in on some real serious charges. And whose fault is that? Mi amor, no podía. I couldn't help it. Y tú lo sabes. Tienes que confiar en mí. Trust you? I did trust you, and now I'm going to be here until... I don't even know until when. I got somebody working on it. It's just going to take some time. And what do I do in the meantime? You know they got girls in here that want to rip my face off? Take it easy. I got something for you. What? Take it. What? Take it. Are you crazy? Well, you just take it. What am I supposed to do with this? Just keep it. You're gonna need it. Paco, if I get caught with this... You won't get caught. Just hide it in some place safe. There's no place safe in here, Paco. You know that. Okay, five minutes to lights out. Don't fuck yourself. Screw you. I'm dead. Yes. Why not? You want it. No. You want it, don't you? Please. Say it. No. You never know when this might come in handy. Billy, put it away. It scares me. Sure. Sure, we got better things to do, don't we? Uh, Billy? What? Come on, Lori. You and me both know why we parked out here. This ain't no time to play hard to get. I'm not. I just want you to be gentle. You want me to go easy? Hey, I'll go easy. How's this? Okay? How's this? And this? so sweet. Billy, I don't think we should do this anymore. What? Don't talk like that, honey. I was just going to ask you to do me a favor. What? You're so good. 
thought you could help me out. I got a couple of friends who want to meet you. What? Take it away, guys. She's all yours. Come on, you little whore. You did it for me. You do it for my buddies. You take care of that little dope fiend like I told you? Yep. She's dusted. I might find you down here some night. Take that off. Take that off. Anybody up, they'll kill me. 
Where? Downstairs. There's water in the boiler room. And it's away from everything else. You know what girl took her life last night? Second in a month, as I understand it. I felt this would help relieve the tension. to where you belong. Now. I'd keep my mind on my job if I were you. That is, if I wanted to keep it.
gotta get out of here. I need to get laid bad. Any more news from your ma? We're getting real close, Rebel. We'll be with Ma sooner than you think. There's something I think you should know. Paige, uh, would you get me something to drink, please? Thank you. Don, may I call you Don? I think it would be best if you did not develop a personal relationship with any of my girls. They become very dependent, and it can only cause problems. I wish this girl wouldn't smoke. What is going on here? I think this little girl is high, Miss Madison. Lori, is this true? No. He, he... I'm, a, I'm afraid. Night in solitary is all that is going to calm you down, Lori. And then tomorrow we will talk about drugs. Sparazza, will you take this girl to solitary? Harper. Anybody ever tell you you have your head up your ass? You're really looking for you? The dorm. Five minutes.
This ain't over yet. Anytime you say. I've been waiting for this. You're gonna get a little girl. You've been asking for it. You're gonna get it. somebody else besides yourself for a change. Make sure no one comes in. walking on eggshells with me. Oh, please. Nobody say nothing. Come on. What the hell are you gonna do with a baby in this joint? One more word out of you, and I'm gonna break your eyeballs. Look, nobody tells anybody anything. What you talking about? We gotta break her out of here. And in the meantime, we'll make a little nest in the basement. Now, Regan.
You were not raped. I was. Laurie, I know you want to get out of here, but you must know that making up stories is not going to help you. You put me in solitary, and McCoy came in and raped me. That is the truth. You are not going to make me believe that my staff could be capable of such actions. I'm telling you the truth. Don't do this to me, Laurie. What am I doing? I'm telling you what happened. You are trying to cause problems for me, and I will not allow it. I was raped. Don't cross me, Laurie. Don't give me problems. You will regret it. You don't even know what's going on in here. If you did, I know you wouldn't be this way. There is nothing going on in here that I'm not aware of. This place is coming apart. And if you don't know what's happening, you'd better find out soon. Don't threaten me, Lori. I can make your time here very easy or very difficult. The decision is yours. Teresa, get me Dr. DiMarco. Lisa's ma, she was doing a liquor store. They killed her dead. Stevens, I didn't see you. Shouldn't you be in the factory? I am. I just had to go to the little girl's room. All right, we'll get back to where you belong. Now. Okay. Rob, 
trouble. What's shaking, honey? All kinds of things, honey. Oh, yeah? Like what? Some new stuff just came in. You want in on it? Do I? You know that I do. Good. Why don't you come down to the basement with me? Let's see if we can't cut a deal. You got it. So what's the deal? Don't worry, I said we cut it. in that room behind the boiler. They won't find her for years. What's everybody gonna think happened to her? She escaped. What do you think, you dumb twat? Come on, get her out of here. I want you about interfering, Lori. Interfering? No one else was handling the situation. What was I supposed to do? You were supposed to leave whatever had to be done to us. You didn't seem to be able to do anything. What does it take to get through to you? I don't know what you mean. You know exactly what I mean. You are in a very serious danger of ending up under lock and key for a very long time. Why are you threatening me? Because I did your job. I do my job. And I do it well. I have been able to convince Paige to see her father. I can convince anyone to do anything. Even you. We'll see. Yes. We will see. I'm glad you decided to see me, Paige. It's important to me that we have this time together. I'm not here because I want to be. You're my daughter, and I love you. You love me. I've seen I have shown that. I know that, that I've done things that were wrong. Wrong. I want to make it up to you. I want you to love me as much as I love you. You are incredible. I know what you're thinking. That's in the past. I, I, I couldn't help myself. It's a sickness. I know it. Please, under... Try to understand me. Forgive me. You don't exist for me. You're not even alive. You're dead. I hate you. You brutalize me. Hate. I'm in a living hell because of you. You molested me. Please, keep your voice. I've seen people deal drugs, sell their bodies. I know who they all are. When I tell what I know, that whole place will come down. And if you come down too, it makes what I've gone through worth it. You're disgusting!
What are you in such a hurry for? Somebody could walk in at any moment. What are you talking about? Everybody's doing the factory. It's only 4.30. I don't take chances. Uh-huh. Well, what are you doing here in the first place? Well, don't give me shit. You get what you want, and I get what I want. Well, you little bitch. You love it. Now give me what you promised. You know, Rebel, you're using more of that than you ought to be. Uh-huh. And I ain't the only one. Now give me. Now get out. Rebel, we both got what we came here for. You can get me off, but that's it. And I want some real action. I don't want a bitch. I want a man. Oh, well, Marina, I've been looking for you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you know the files in the basement? Well, there are some records I need. I think you'll find them in these stacks. Could you do this for me? If you want. Thanks. Scared you? No. no. I thought it was about time you and me had a little talk. About what? Well, don't bullshit me, lady. You got busted for dealing, right? So they say. So how'd you like to keep on doing business right here on the inside? I would not like. You gotta learn to play nice. Think it over. We'll talk again. Maybe this will help you remember. Not your business. Paige just took a bad fall down the stairs. How though? General, Martin, there are great amounts of these supplies missing, Dr. Timarco. And I want an explanation. There's no explanation necessary, Miss Madison. The demand in the last few months has exceeded the supply. We've had to use the reserves to keep these girls under control. Who do you think you are talking to? A critic? You would have to inject every girl in this facility four times a day, every day of the week, for a year, to deplete all the reserves. There has been a certain amount of petty theft. I think not. Some of these girls are very cunning. And speaking of the girls, I have been hearing some very disturbing rumors regarding your behavior with some of them. From whom? Valeska? You 
are aware that she has left us. I have my sources. Oh, I'm sure you do. Are these stories true? You've been talking to girls who are looking for early releases, and you know it. They'd say anything to get out of here. We will see. I want answers from you, and I want them very soon, Dr. DiMarco. Do I make myself clear? Crystal clear. Good. Just remember. Yes? I am keeping my eye on you. Somebody left the steam table on. I've been waiting for you. Wasn't sure you'd come. She's dead. Who? She's dead. Lori. What? Shh. Lori? Easy. <laughs> Nobody did anything. I... I well, what happened? They came in and took her. I didn't know. I, I didn't who, know. Who are you talking about? Paige. They made it look like an accident, but they killed her. They killed her. Who? Who killed her? Lisa. Rebel. What does it matter? They're all the same. We are all the same. Laura, you know that's not true. We're all the same. We come here and something happens. No matter what we were before, we end up like all the rest of them. Nobody matters. Nobody. Lori. No, don't. I don't know if I can ever... Yes, you can. You aren't everybody else. You're different. What's happening? I don't feel anything. Hold me. Hold me tight. Hold me tight. I wish I could say the same, Doc. But frankly, you may be the worst lay I ever had in my whole little life. And that includes that hot nurse of yours, too. Oh, by the way. Yes. Them drugs you was going to give me? Yes. Why don't you just keep them, honey? It really wasn't worth it. Consider this a mercy fuck.
upset this may be. I don't know if this was gonna happen. What? Lena, I gotta tell you something. The bust? It was me who got you in here. What? Lena, there's a lot of money involved. I gotta deal with the Marco, and Stevens, and somebody else. And I just thought that if you were in here for a while, you know, well, you could help me out. You son of a bitch. No, 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 Lena. You dirty bastard, son no, of a no. bitch. You suckers, leave her alone or it's gonna be blood. Put her in restraints. This is going to be fun. Nobody going nowhere.
Just what we need. One more little Negro. I'm gonna lose my job for this. I don't care. You just lost your job. And nobody's going anywhere. gonna be you and me, huh? I'm not fighting you, Lisa. If you have a fight with anybody, it should be her. What are you talking about? Well, you know who's doing the drugs here. You know it!
Lori, what is... Here's a new girl. You have pretty eyes. Yeah, <laughs> 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 